All right, here we go. Whipping setup, ready to go. Long leader, very, very long leader to my grub right there. And uh, the water is extremely low right now. So basically right when the lure hits the water, you gotta start cranking basically right away. And you really, you just wanna have the, the bubble float run straight across the surface like that. And uh, what that actually imitates is that imitates the um, other papillo feeding. Papillo are kind of like uh, like other offshore fish, or they act like offshore fish, where once they see or hear other uh, predator fish biting or attacking, they, it kind of triggers them to bite also. So that's why the, the leader has to be super long, because they're going to see and hear the commotion of the bubble float or the hammer bomb and then when they basically they look to see what that was then they see the the grub right behind them so yeah that's that's how whipping works and um, these fish are mobile they kind of come and go. Ooh. Oh no, that's uh, that's all the uh, hogfish out there, needlefish. So the fish kind of come and go. They they make their rounds. So since the fish are moving, you kind of could stay in the same spot. If you're in a like a high percentage spot, you just kind of like keep casting in the same spot and basically wait for the the fish to come back around to you. And anyone who's never fished like that before would be like really si like surprised how fast you really have to to run these lures. It wasn't until I was uh, doing this for the first time, and you know I'm used to fishing for largemouth bass and fresh water, and over there you work real slow finesse type uh, retrieves. But that's absolutely not what these Papio want. They want fast, fast retrieve. Like they want the they want the the bait to be basically scared. Because when the bait fish are scared and disoriented, like that's when they feel like they have the best chance of catching them. Super shallow right now. Oh, oh, oh my God. Yes. Woo. Oh, there's a nice school of them too. Oh, I'm on. Nice Papillo. Oh, there's like five more of them right there. Oh, there's a huge school. Of, there's like 10 of them. And this is like one of the bigger ones too. Holy crap. Here it comes. Yeah, yeah nice one. There you go. Oh, freaking perfect. Nice, this is legal size too. Look how blue the fish is nice this is a bluefin bluefin trevally oh hook popped out you guys like them yeah here you guys haven't put lines in yet <laughs> you guys didn't even put lines in yet huh <laughs> Nice, yeah, the, the the school. There's like ten of them. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah. There, there's more out there. Nice, you like it. Oh, 
Oh, I, I like them, but I, I don't got a place to put them right now. I'll just. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I'll, I'll see what else I can catch then. <laughs> yeah, because I wasn't even trying to fish. I was just in town, and I saw the. You see the sardines. Yeah, yeah, they chase you a little bit. Yeah. So then I was like, well, I always keep one in the car, you know, <laughs> just to stay ready. <laughs> Yeah, I, I got one bag. I'll, I'll take it as I go, maybe. Okay, okay. Yeah. All right, thanks, guys. Thanks, yeah. Dang, <laughs> that was perfect. Stay ready.